All right, welcome to A Missing Salesman. This looks like it's a newer game off of Itch. Um, I tried to read the description, but it was extremely vague. It just said you have to play through this game and pay attention uh, to everything, and I, I suppose it's pretty atmospheric. Um, so yeah, let's check this out, see how it goes. Okay, I have some tasks to do. That's what it says in the top left. Sorry, my monitor's a little... It's pretty wide, so I kind of have to make do here. Uh, so my tasks... I don't have any tasks yet. Ooh, you can hear my feet. The mouse is pretty good. I'll have to give him that. A lot of times in these games, the mouse is way too sensitive. Is that a jellyfish? Oh, and that's a kitty cat. <laughs> Just like a standard house cat. And this is a deadly box jellyfish from Africa. I don't know that for certain, but um, yeah, it looks like one. I guess I'm not waiting for the bus. Me. I finally got home from work. There doesn't seem to be anything to eat at home. I should go to the store. Eat to continue. Okay. I assume the store is down this one-way street. Totally silent in the middle of the woods. Are the trees sideways? They are. I don't know if you can see that. Maybe I'll... You know, the gamma is sometimes really weird in these games. Um, let me get next to one of them. No, it's, it's pretty dark. <laughs> All the trees look like they're sideways, though. The trunks are. It's really weird. Huh. Oh, how convenient. A grocery store. It says grocery. Yes, yes. Uh, buy pizza. That's something I absolutely know how to do. No, no sound on the door. That's strange. Ooh. Well, it's definitely PSX style. <laughs> I can barely see the guy's face. It just looks like a little peach blob over there. And unfortunately, I can't read. Get the pizza in the blue freezer. Okay, get the pizza in the blue freezer. Fortunately, I can't read any of the uh, any of the snacks here because sometimes they have really funny names in these games. Get the pizza in the freezer. The pizza in the freezer. Pizza in the blue freezer. That's a green freezer. That's a blue freezer. Okay. Oh, I have been in this uh this garage or not this garage, this um this gas station before. I recognize this door placement. Um like I couldn't say what game it was from, but you know, they all kind of blur together over time, so well, let's talk to the guy first. Oh, okay. He looks like a a regular dude when you get up close. There's a little smile on his face. Can't really see his eyes, though. They kind of look like they're closed. Oh, I see Pocky here. Strawberry and chocolate and... Is that... I don't know what that kind is. Um, are these VHSs or DVDs? That looks weird. Uh, maybe some Kit Kats. Maybe some Reese's. Uh, some crunch bars. Mm. Okay, I don't need lottery tickets. Oh, 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 open up. That's a giant pizza. <laughs> There's a bunch of, uh, what is it? Uh, little, uh, whatever you call them. They're not candy bars. Why am I forgetting what these are called? <laughs> ice cream bars. Yes, ice cream bars. Uh, of all kinds. And a giant extra large pizza that's unwrapped sitting on top. I guess I'll take this. Uh, is there anything else that I need? No, just the giant pizza. No napkins. No water. No nothing. 
get the pizza in the blue freezer. I did get the pizza. Oh, now we talk. Hello, I'd like to buy a pizza. Good evening. Sure, that'll be $10. The text generation is a little slow. Okay. Thank you for buying. Enjoy your evening. You too. I suppose I will. Uh, go home. Go home with your pizza. Middle of the night. Um, I assume home is at the bus station where I came from? That would make the most sense, right? I'm going to walk down the middle of the street. In the light. Because I know these games. And my headphones are up real loud right now. I really don't want to catch a really nasty jump scare holding my pizza. Almost back. Can I sprint with the pizza? Nope. That would be sad if I sprinted forward and tripped on myself and landed on my pizza. Unless home is just down the road more. That's like one of my other major complaints about some of these games is like when you have to just wander like outside of a, a car that's broken down. Uh, sometimes you go the wrong direction because they don't really give you an indicator. All right, so let's take this piece and just keep going back the way we came. That's the word I was looking for, popsicle. They were popsicles. <laughs> I was like, ice cream bar? It's called something else. Popsicle. I haven't had popsicle in ages. Can't even remember the last popsicle I ate. Maybe it was like an otter pop. Hmm. Well, the game ain't too scary so far. I have a pizza. There's plenty of light. Uh, yeah, let's just go home. Oh, okay. There's like no sound effects. There's like my feet moving. That's it. Eat a pizza. Eat a pizza. Eat the pizza. Ah, look at that. It's beautiful. I don't know what's with the white ring in the middle of it. Um, do I have anything else in this house? Oh, 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 I have a big shiny toilet. Does this light work? No. What else do I have here? Nothing. Nothing. Man, I have one window in my home. It's not a bad home. It's just kind of empty. Well, let's eat this pizza. Let's celebrate. Oh. Why the lights turn off as soon as I ate the pizza? Usually doesn't happen to me. Uh, why is everything red? Why is it red in that room? I'm scared. I leave. Let's leave. <laughs> Let's look around back. Now there's nothing back there. This is gonna be loud, isn't it? And it's gonna scare the crap out of me. Oh. Oh. oh, fuck me! Oh my god! What is that? What a... I might have to turn this down if it's like super loud. Hang on. Uh. I'm sensing that this is gonna be pretty loud. Okay. Alright. You come down to about 50. There we go. That's livable. What has he done to me? He sucked me into some kind of uh, shadow realm or something. Some upside down realm. Where it's floating appliances. Um, oh lord, what, is, what does this being want with me now? Player, who are you? I'm you. Oh, that's freaky. Uh, no you're not. What does that mean? How can you be me? Let's wait in to your oil. Okay. Go to sleep. Uh, yeah, let's sleep after that. Turn the lights on. Oh, you know, I'm sleeping with the lights on. Forget that. 
Um, what else do we have here? Fairly decently sized TV. But I mean, look at those bezels though. What is this? 2010? Um, let's sleep. Let's, let's go to sleep. Let's advance the narrative. Sleep. Ellipses. Put the dirty laundry in the washer. The dirty laundry. What dirty laundry? This place is so clean. The dirty laundry. Oh, well, there's a ducky. Oh, there's some dirty laundry. Okay. Oh, is he wearing a hat? Is he wearing a hat? Oh. Look at that. Can I zoom in? No. A little ducky wearing a top hat. Just chilling by himself. Well, I'm not scared anymore. Um, put the dirty laundry in the washer. This is the washer, yeah? Put the toilet paper in the toilet. In the toilet? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, next to the toilet. They don't have like a toilet paper holder or anything in the wall. I guess not. It's rough living. Why did it even flash that guy's that guy right in front of me? That, that didn't go to the store. All right, well let's go back. Go back to the store. I should close my house though. Yeah. <coughs> oh my gosh. Hmm. But yeah, I'm still recovering. I came back from a trip, caught COVID in the airport. And then took Paxlovid and got better and then tested negative And then a couple days later just tested positive again. But I don't have like a fever or anything. I just have like um, some throat stuff going on. So I'm still recovering. But I figured I'd play a bunch of um, horror games while I was recovering. Just to eat up some time. So this has been fun. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Into the store. Oh, well, that guy's new. Oh no, it's the same guy. This is the guy that jump scared the shit out of me. Hey, the store's closed. Why? Did something happen? The salesman couldn't get to work. Something must have happened to him. Hmm. Oh, yeah, this is a different guy from before, huh? Okay. I'll come back later. All right. Um, I don't know where that guy is. Maybe he's stuck in that... <laughs> Uh, you know, upside down, outworld, hell dimension, or something. What the hell is this? Missing. Oh, this is the guy. <laughs> That's the guy that jump scared me in my own home. Uh, he seems like a nice guy. Um, I don't know if there's something standing behind him there. That's just his shadow on the wall, but he is missing. He is missing. Um, well, go home. I kind of like how this game tells you exactly what to do. Oh, what is going on now? What is that? Oh, these are hands. These are like little CG hands that are sticking up out of the ground. This is mildly disturbing. Hi. Oh, these are all the same person? Huh. Oh no, it's that weird talking entity thing again. Oh, or not. He's gone. Blood red sky. A dead body in my front lawn. You know, the usual. Um. Uh, is that the guy? Hey, I found the missing guy. He's here. I solved the I solved the case. He's dead on my lawn. Um, who else is dead in here? Tasks? Question mark? Question mark? Question mark? You're telling me I didn't do this? Oh, okay. Maybe I did do this. Who's that? Who's that? Is that me? a gun there oh there's a note uh, 
Let's read it. My name is Bob. I'm 27 years old, and I'm schizophrenic. I'm tired of living like this. I think I killed the store clerk. I can't tell reality from illusion, and tonight, 29-2016, I'm going to kill myself. Well, that's not good. Oh no. Is that me and this is like my lost soul? Oh no. Oh. I'm crossing and astasy. Uh, assets have been used. Okay, cool. Well, hang on, let me turn that down even more. Well, that was short and sweet, I think. Um, very basic. Good job, McCrossin and Astasy. Make sure to check their stuff out. Um, the atmosphere was pretty good. I mean, I think we could use a little bit more um, sound effects. Although that did have its own aesthetic, like um, just the silence and the, the, the feet moving and everything like that. Um, I think it could benefit a little bit more from a little more sound. Maybe maybe some creepy music now and then. And maybe the sounds of doors opening and closing and stuff like that. Because those can be pretty disturbing, I think. Especially in sounds when it's really quiet. You just hear a door slam or something like that. It can be pretty cre creepy. So, I think it could benefit from that. Um, I didn't have a problem at all with the story. I like the, um, the little twist at the end. Where you see that actually you've just been a wandering soul like kind of the whole time and um that something horrible had happened uh yeah the the jump scare was pretty scary i didn't expect to see that guy like in my house and it was weird that his face was so happy so that was kind of scary at the same time oh and i did like the way that the big black entity talked um that was really loud in my headphones but it was sounded so weird that it was really kind of unsettling um so yeah maybe maybe more of that i feel like it could have expanded this one a bit actually and drawn it out a little bit longer it was actually pretty short um but that's not a problem i think um especially if this is kind of uh, the beginnings of uh you know somebody just starting to expand their work and stuff like that this is a great place to start so pleasantly surprised it was shorter than i thought it would be i will say that um but the jump scare did get me and i did like um the whole suicide um a weird you know stuck in limbo kind of a thing that was going on with this so yeah great job um across it and asked to Z. uh loved it uh keep them coming i will definitely check out more if i can find it so yeah a great little horror experience had a lot of the elements that I really like just needs a little more sound I think though so um, yeah um, have a good night I'll probably dig up another game and play it pretty soon here so yeah thanks see ya bye